It is a sport that captivates an ice boat skimming on a frozen lake. And this week, the DN North American Championship Regatta is on Lake Monona. More than 100 sailors from around the world are in Madison. Dave Delosier says everything was in place for the race, except the one thing you can't control. What are we doing out here? We're um, here for the DN North American Championships. A coming together of sorts with boats from far and wide. I think we have six nations um, and then boats from uh, all the way up the East Coast, Canada, Sweden, Hungary, um, Poland are here. Which is why Luann Schultz had to see what was going on. I uh, just wanted to see what all entails with this uh, regatta. And the... the sport involves ice boats, but from a distance, the ice part seemed to be a problem. Seems like it might not even be safe, actually, right now, because it's it was kind of warm over the weekend, and even today it is. But, but it actually isn't the ice that's a problem for this sailing event. Everybody's ready to go. Everybody, except Mother Nature. Sails don't work real well without the wind. We want to run a fair race for everybody. It's not a lot of fun to see who's the best track star. Well, I see them walking with their sailboats, but I don't see anybody actually moving along and sailing. <laughs> oh, my God, you need the conditions. I'm from New Jersey, so you need the ice. It could be hard, it could be soft, there could be snow drifts, there could be wind, there could be no wind, it could be gusty. I mean, it could go any, any way you want it to go, you know? Or it can go like today, which didn't. Uh, like a lot of great sports, we stand around two-thirds of the time waiting for the right conditions. Which allows time for the stories to start. After, uh, I've been doing it since 1971, you, you tend to hear the same stories over and over again. Stories about when the wind and ice cooperate. It draws the speed and camaraderie and just fun of sailing. Which is what brought them all here in the first place. Hopefully they'll get some wind and they can get something going here. On Lake Monona. I don't know, just chase the race, I guess. This is Dave Delosier, WISC News 3. Late this afternoon, enough wind came up to allow a few qualifying races to take place. Weather permitting, the event will continue tomorrow. But high winds are possible for Wednesday, which again could be a problem. Winds above 20 knots are considered too high for racing.